Yeah, good evening, everyone. Good morning, good afternoon, uh, from whatever location you are. I uh, want to uh, welcome you to this evening, AMA. This is uh, Admin Ambrose, all the way from Italy, staying on to anchor this program this very evening. I want to thank every great admin that is on this platform right now, every Spartan from wherever you are joining us all over the world, in the US, in the um, in Africa, in uh, Portugal, in wherever continent, in whatever region of the country that you are joining us from, we are welcome to this uh, very meeting this evening. And um, it is going to be a very quick armor, and I believe we're going to have a very sweet time with ourselves. Uh, we're having questions popping in from left, right, and center. My DM is filled to the brim. I hardly could uh, get all the questions that were sent in. Don't blame me, though, because I was still able to, you know, uh, put some of them together because most of the questions came in a way that I need to paraphrase them and be able to rearrange them in a way that I can go to the main area of the question, you know. But that notwithstanding, I'm sure we're going to help ourselves all together. I would believe that the CEO is already here with us, and in no distance time, we'll be introducing him, um, bringing him on board, and it will be great saying hi to the entire family. Uh, this today, Ama is going to be more or less like uh, a discussion on the family talk and the, the CEO addressing the community. And there will be that possibility for us to have a direct uh, access to ask uh, questions directly to the CEO on the live uh, question uh, page. So we're going to go in this format since I already have a lot of questions that have been sent to my DM. Some I could collate, some I couldn't because they are really many, really, really many. Okay, so we're going to be giving room for live questions, and at the same time, maybe after one or two live questions, then we, we also take um, <clears throat> questions from those who have sent theirs in. So in that way, we'll be able to cover everybody. But one thing I want to beg is that when you know that your question has been asked, especially from the written question and so on and so forth, please don't bother to uh, bring up any question in that regards anymore. Okay, so. We'll please ask you to help us so that we can also help you. Once again, thank you very, very much for joining us this evening. Uh, see you, uh, let me believe that you are already here with us because I know you are a very good timekeeper. So uh, to prove that to all that you are here, can you just please uh, unmute yourself, see you and uh, greet the community, then we know that you are already with us. Yeah. Uh... Compliments of the season, guys. Good afternoon. Good evening. Good morning and good night in any part of the world or you are. Jess and Michael here reporting. Uh, it's going to be a quick one. Who will be answering all of your questions, please. If your friends are not here, mostly those who are very good in a uh, uh, doing guest work or uh, uh, paying attention more to naysayers than looking at reality, proofs and facts. Please invite them on board. We need to talk. Thank you. I'm Bruce, over to you. Yeah, thank you very, very much. I'll see you. Uh, that was a quick one. Uh, we're going to be going straight uh, to what we have. So, um, in a nutshell, uh, we got. Um, a very sharp and um, a quick update from you earlier in the day about a very uh, grievous attack that was on the site. And, um, you know, we, we uh, thank God that the system was able to uh, go off and uh, uh, make provisions for safety. So I really want to say uh, one or two things as regards to that, as many Spartans want to know, the state of our present uh, uh, site as it seems be not accessible to a few hours back, if not up to now. Yeah, see you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Ambrose. Uh, yeah, attack <laughs> uh, from day one, nine months ago, 10 months ago, 11 months ago, and last year, December, making it a 12th month of the preparation of AAF. I told every one of you. I, Jess and Michael, being the pilot, right, of AAF, I came very prepared. I didn't come to trade wells, no. I didn't come to battle wells, no. I didn't come to sit down and look at naysayers and cry about what they are saying, no. 
but to turn their minds to see the reality of things and see how tech work. Tech is different from the centralized system. So I didn't come to look at their faces and shed tears. No, rather I came to turn the table to their faces. We have a series of attacks today making it the 69 attack, 69. AAS live trading started on the 4th. From 4th to today, it's 69 attack. And last night was something else. Last night was a global attack hitting the defense, the security of AAS to see if they can penetrate. But it wasn't working. It was not going through because we didn't come to trade wells. We knew too well they will attack. You see, I, I have a lot to, to, to talk to the community. I have a lot to discuss today. And I have a lot to feed the community with, to enlighten them. We didn't host our system in the cloud, whereby we are giving room for everybody to have access to their capital because everybody is our capital. Hey, <laughs> a day like yesterday, if the system was a host in the cloud, and leaving our liquidity pool open in, in, in the open field or leaving it in the zombie account where everybody see or have access to. Yeah, see you, we lost you. Um, I think we have to have yes. you back as soon as possible. Are you back, CEO? Okay, um, perhaps it could be network issue. Uh, please, if anyone can uh, in any way uh, send a background message to see you, let him know that we've lost him. Because since he's still talking from the background, but we're having a kind of uh, a glitch. Uh, that notwithstanding, uh, we're going to give room for him to come because um, he's the one that will be able to speak to us on major issues. And... Okay. Yeah, we are hearing you now, but um, it's not it's not coming straight. It's uh, being truncated in a way. Maybe your network, your internet uh, network, sir. Yeah, why why he fits that and uh, puts things in order? Uh, we just have to keep going. Um, actually, he was giving us a very very useful and important information, uh, which. Uh, uh, he has the privilege as the designer of the of the website and also the designer of the project and being the chief engineer of the back end as well, which he has privilege to see, which we are not privy to see. So um, it's like when a soldier in the war front is just telling you how the war is going, you know, he's talking from experience and he's talking from what actually he saw, you know. So uh, we will certainly have to hold on for CEO to get connected back so that uh, he can finish on that thought of uh, on that line of thought that he was and uh, we could move on to other issues so see you if okay, you are I'm, back. I'm here okay thank you very much we can hear you now loud and clear yeah go ahead sir thank you uh we have series of attacks 69 and last night was something else we were on our toes watching to see how they can come in how they can penetrate it's not a challenge with all our humility. We build a system that has security on its own. We build a system to turn the face of the market. We build a system to turn the table upside down. We build a system that has one of the best security. And those of you who are very good in listening to naysayers, if we were to leave the capital, your funds rather, in the open field, just like the way you wanted it, every other system that we built before now, their phones were in the open field, either in the hot wallet. If the attack comes, you see them moving the phones from the hot wallet to a cold wallet to protect the phones. But I told everybody, no, this is not what I came in for. And every other person is, why didn't you leave the phones? Leave it open. So that if we want to withdraw, we withdraw our capital. Hey. It's Abrahamic to build a system and leave the funds open. In the open field, no, it's Abrahamic. It, 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 it's too old to do that. You don't, they ask mistakes you don't make. You see, 
one funny thing with life is to watch the mistakes of a man, which you know these are mistakes from a man, and uh, directly or indirectly, you are trying to repeat the same mistakes. It's insanity. No, it's a high level of insanity. We sat down, myself, the deep team, we looked at the loopholes, the weaknesses, and the strengths of platforms that were sustained, and the weaknesses of the platform that failed. We decided to build a different model. Last night was something else. But one good thing about the system we built is the more you attack, the more the system shuts itself down. The more you attack, the more the system shuts itself down and then come up again. You attack, it shuts itself. I don't need to be there. That already has been programmed. That already has been settled. That already is in place or running on its own. I don't need to be there. The deep team don't need to be there. But once the attack starts coming, we will have signals that are stuck on it. And we will be awake to watch to see what they are doing. But one funny thing is this the more they attack, the more I fold my hands. It's quite unfortunate. I don't drink last night. I feel like drinking. I just feel like having a, a glass of wine while they attack to drink. But it's quite unfortunate. I don't know how to drink. But I was washing them. I keep laughing. I, we were just making jest of them, washing to see how they can come in. The system. Keep shutting and coming up. And I have to come to the room to tell everyone of you guys the system will be going off. Now, I want you to rest. I didn't come to trade wells. I build a system, a system I can go to bed to sleep with. So, a lot of attacks, attacks are still ongoing. And one funny thing with systems is this if systems are built, you expect these guys to come up and Attack. If they don't attack, then you, you, you don't have the system on ground. For those of you who have given the system before now, who has given the platform with me four, five, six months ago, if the platform launched that was July, August, I told every one of you, hey, this guy has a good concept, but he holds the platform in the cloud. He won't last. The platform never lasts for 21 days. They crash him off. You can build a system in the cloud, a financial system. They will make a mess of you. So, guys, what they are doing is okay. What they are doing is right. They are uh, giving me that assurance that I build a system that a man can't come in except you. And have it at the back of your mind. You can't go to blockchain to take funds. So, stop attacking us. The more you attack, the more we buckle up. Thank you. Back to you, and Bruce. Thanks to every spot and there waiting. Thank you. Yeah, thank you very much, CEO. I think that is a high level of confidence there to some, uh, to most of us, uh, especially uh, Spartans who are keen about their capitals. Uh, yeah, in that same line, in that same uh, action, uh, in that same uh, line of thought as regards uh, uh, the website being attacked, uh, we have a Spartan here who wrote a question, and it's by name Allah, A-L-E-A-A. -A -A. So that is the name, and he has the series of questions that we'll try to go over one after the other. Uh, in case of um, attack of this nature that we'll be talking about, we're happy that, according to him, that the website has been designed to withdraw in as a snail whenever this attack comes. So his question is that, what happens since we as Spartan don't know when this attack will come? Maybe we are funding, or we are withdrawing, or we are just making a, a top up, for example, and all of a sudden the attack comes, and the timer has not gone off for the uh, the phone to be to arrive at AAS or for the uh, withdrawal to come out into your wallet, and the site automatically shut down. What now happened to our fund? Will it be registered as a failed transaction, or will it still go successfully behind on the blockchain? See you. Okay, thank you, thank you. Ambris, you need to work on your audio is breaking. Um, let me answer your question. Uh, one, money does not got missing in the blockchain. Okay, just look at yesterday, some of our members were withdrawing, why some were funded when the attack came in and the system shut that right. That money will never got missing, no. It's in the blockchain. Once we trigger it up, which few hours from now, it will be up right on 
the withdrawals will go to your funding the pending within the liquidity pool will only ask you to send us your email address then we rectify it and push back to you right that's what we are going to do so money will never got missing in the blockchain that is not possible it has never been in the history of blockchain that money got missing no then two uh, 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 what happened if the attacks are coming the cyber we were operating with it was not a private cyber Yeah, we need you back, see you. I think since um, Telegram is very funny today, or uh, could it be our various network? So, yeah, um, I can hear you. okay, you are I back again you. now. You are back yeah. again. Go ahead, see you. So thank you. Now, the, the cyber we were operating with was a hired cyber. We, 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 we hired it. It was not our private cyber. As I speak to you, the arrangement is ongoing of our own EAS private cyber, where we have total control of what is happening. Then two, for the fact that EAS is a global platform, you don't expect hungry Yahoo boys to attack the platform. They don't even have what it takes to attack the hungry, hungry, uh, the care, hungry Yahoo boys. These are not the ones who don't, they, they can't attack EAS, it's beyond them. Not Ponzi masters, no. Those ones are hungry. We are talking about global hackers, unethical hackers, right? So for the fact that AAS is a global platform, expect global attack now, but who build a system in a way that nothing you can do to go in? Nothing with all humility, I'm telling you this. Before we launched AAS, I told every one of you, I build a system from failure experience, from pains, from disappointment, from finger bones, tears, stop bleeding, rather blood gushing from my eye. I decided to sit back, design a system that can stand the test of time with all humility, sir. So, expect this attack to keep coming. But one funny thing is this what they need to know is this liquidity pool is locked. Not even me who design it can go in. It's not possible. Some more of you is attacking. It's locked. The funnel within the funds of AAS is locked in the blockchain. For you to hack, you need permission of the 589,240 global computers. You need them. If you can have access to 500,000 plus computers, go ahead and have EES. But if you can't have access to them, just rest. Join forces with me. Let us better the life of Ham, the life of the less privileged, homeless, fatherless, widows. Look at the government of every country. The economy is crashing. They need tech. They need tech to better their lives. To wake up and meet up, join forces with me. Let us build tech and help humanity. Attacking me makes no sense. Attacking me will not change anything. Attacking me will not give you room to penetrate. I didn't come to trade wells. I build a system. <laughs> I'll bring back to you. Thank you. Yeah, thank yeah. you. Thank you. Thank you very much, CEO. Yeah, we're still on the the same thought of question. Like, uh, uh, once want to know uh, this the same person, Allah, uh, asking that um, is there is there no additional security feature that can be added to the website to prevent it from this constant shutdown? As this is not encouraging to uh, prospect because each time they have somebody they want to register, and as soon as they want to log in to create an account, you see that the site is down and prospect are complaining. So is there no other better security feature or additional that can be added? Instead of the site to shut down, it can still be working, but with a way these uh, attacks. Okay, thank you. Uh, Allah, let me answer you straight here. It's better the cyber shut down than run out of funds. Before now, if a hackers, I'm not talking about players, I'm talking about unethical. They want to hack into the liquidity pool and take funds. That is their work. That is their business. That is what they do for a living. 
Now, before now, if attacks are coming into a cyber, just like AS cyber, you won't hear shut down. The next thing is, they pull out social amount of money, social amount of money is gone, they are still withdrawing, or they are in control of your side, and then they are making demands. You have a $500 billion in the account, we want $250, $250 billion, you take half, we take half. That has been. But here we came up with a different model to say, no, for them to have access, no. What do we do? Program it to shut down than give them access or grant them access. Now, with all humility, sir, is better the attack. If the attack become so heavy on the system, let the system shut down and pop up again. Then two, we have more than five cybers. Sorry to tell you this. This uh, um, AMT meeting, we need to talk. You need to know what we build, why we build it this way, and why we are going to run for a long period of time. Not one year, not two years, not 10 years. No, no, no. So we build a system that if the attack comes, the system should shut itself down and pop up again. And we have over five different cybers. And each of the cyber has their own function in the system. Because of this, if the attack come and the surface, the surface of the platform shut down, which is our own site shut down, that does not stop other browsers from browsing. Uh, uh, two, three days ago, you noticed when I told you attack came in, these guys attacked us, what happened? Our own site was down, but uh, 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 other other browsers are going. You can pass other browsers to go into the system, do your withdrawal, do your funding, register members, or bring in your friends. But our own was shut down. Why? Because we designed it that way. You can't come in. That was a plan. And so now we have uh, so many cybers, right? That work on their own. In the system, okay, just presently the system is down. You are not seeing, but we are seeing from our end. Return on investment drop that was few hours ago. And the trading is still ongoing. We then design a system that if the attackers attack, then trading will stop. That was what other guys were doing. That has been in place before now. They designed their own that way that if attack comes in, what next? They shut down the site, shut down operation, no more trading, no more profit. Either they are going to move to a new cyber to start all over again. But I told the deep team, we you know we can't do this. We need to think out of the box and give the community what they want. Not what we want, what they want. Now, if you come to attack our system called AAF, the site will go off. The trading is ongoing. It will never stop the trading and it will never stop return on investment. It has never been this way. We came up with it. Probably when you wake up tomorrow to build your system, you can build it this way. Maybe a, 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 a build data. Then as for the security, it's not everything I'll tell you here. <laughs> it's not everything I'll tell you here. The truth is that we've advanced. You see, the more they attack, the more we advance. The more they attack, the more we advance. The more they attack, the more we plan, right? The more they think, the more we plan. The more they plan, the more we think to better the security of the but one thing is certain and sure, you can't go to a blockchain to take on. As your programmers around you, go, you if you have access to any they are here, they are here. Ask them what they are going through. Ask them, they will tell you that the system is a no-go area. You can't take money from a blockchain. Blockchain that is not, you cannot even me who program. If I can't take money from it, an outsider can't take money from it. So it's what possible. So we we'll keep advancing, we we'll keep um, improving, we keep building more, pushing more cybers to make sure what we have is the best for the community. Thank you. Thanks, Ambrose. Over to you. That is also uh, another reassuring one. Uh, let's uh, let's a bit drift away from uh, the issue of attack and so on and so forth. Um, is there a way to overcome the 10K withdrawal limit? And this may drive away big investors. Is there a way we're planning to overcome this uh, 10K daily withdrawal limit? Okay, thank you. Matthew, from day one, our plan was unlimited withdrawal, right? But here we are dealing with uh, a company called Binance, whom our liquidity pool is in their hands, right? 
now, why did we, uh, 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 there are so many principles, why would you leave your liquidity pool under Binance? If I leave my liquidity pool under my custody, you will not want to invest. You don't trust me. You trust Binance, so I should give it to Binance. They should charge me, and they are charging me. I know how much we are paying. Every withdrawal you are making, I know how much Binance is charging us. We are not up to two weeks yet. I was looking at how much Binance has made from us already. But that will never stop us. So now, when you look at a 10,000 withdrawal limit, that was not our plan. But Binance said, hey, we are an institution, a company. We operate in various countries. And every country where we are, there are limits to withdrawals. Binance said this. You can find that from them. There are limits to withdrawals. So if we give you room for unlimited withdrawal, Indirectly, we are shooting ourselves on the foot. So please, it's either you go by our rules, which is 10,000 for your start, as a community improve, as your community grow, as your community grow, we can extend it, but please, can we start with 10,000? It is not okay by you, Mr. Jesper Michael. There are so many exchanges around. Please apply for the liquidity pool. I have no other option because to me, Binance has the best security. And Binance has seen the, the pains, the test, the desire. Where I am heading to, right? I should give them the room to give me that support to enable me fight what I'm in for. So, okay, good and fine. Now, for a start, is $10,000 per day. That is the limit per day, right? Now, we are still going to apply, please. We've done so, so, so job. We are done improving the, the system. We've implemented this. We've integrated this. The system is stable now. The compounding has been implemented into it, or uh, uh, integrated into it. The percentage has grown from 1.6%. So remember, we are moving from 1.6 to 3 to 4 to 5%. Then we roll up from there, right? So we will definitely go back to apply to them to increase. Yeah, I think the network issue yeah. has come again. So we wait until we have a reconnection back with you. See you. Yeah, I think you seem Thank to be you. back. Thank you, Andrew. Go ahead. So, but for now, we are. Yeah, gentlemen and ladies, Spartans in the house, we're so sorry for these uh, glitches. I think this is network issue. Uh, yeah, CEO, you seems to be back again. Uh, can you I'm continue here. from? Yeah. Okay. So Andrews, uh, this is where we are now. Definitely, we see go back to Binance. The ten thousand per day is not enough. They said we will. They said they will give room for improvement, but they want to see how our operations look like what we have on the table, what we can do, and what the community is responding to. So here we are, definitely, we will move about $10,000 to a higher level. But for now, here's where we are. Thank you. Okay, I think that is very swift and clear. I'm sure Spartans love that very answer. Uh, yeah, to you Spartans who are on this floor, I know we've been taking questions from questions that were sent in. So right now, we're going to be going from one to the other, so we don't just keep Spartans on the call within. So if you have a question that is different from what I've been asked, uh, you can have the opportunity to, you know, put up your hands. And um, I will take one more question from my list here. Then I will now look to the uh, to the forum and see how many Spartans have their hand up. Then we will take one or two person. Then we'll come back again to the questions that we have on our list. So I will jump to another question. See you, why Spartans on the floor are preparing to... Uh, ask questions. Um, the, this question is saying that, um, okay, it says, what will be the procedure, especially for anyone who wants to uh, ask for his capital uh, withdrawn in any case? So what will be the procedure for one who wants to withdraw his or her capital? Would there be a button to click at the back office or on our website to request for this? And if there is any of such, how long will it take to be approved 
for somebody to have his capital if he wants it out. See you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Ambrose. Yeah, when we designed the system, we didn't design the system to hold back capital, right? We created room for it whereby members who are willing to take out their capital or they are not interested in ATS, but we didn't design the system to hold no, no, we didn't do that. We are not that greedy, right? Now, this is what we did. We didn't give room for the capital to be at your disposal. Uh, whereby you have access to it. If we did that a day like yesterday, all funds would have been gone. We'll be battling either to move the funds from hot wallet to cold wallet, just like what happened to the mother platform, moving, struggling to see how you can move funds. No, it's Abrahamic. We are not COTPS. No, it's a good platform. It's a mother platform. They don't, they are best, but the truth is that they are mistakes. We can repeat. No, you don't. You don't repeat mistakes. It's wrong. Right, we lock it up in the blockchain. Don't go in except your spirit. If your spirit go in, if you are not a spirit, please leave the blockchain alone. It, it's not working. Now, what we did was this uh, uh, once we open up or the blockchain open up rather, and you are not interested in trading with AAX, this is what you need to do just apply. Either you send uh, a message to admin, you are not interested in AAX. You want to close up your account. One day for that to meet the requirement, you have to send your very email address because the system is not, does not recognize your name. That your email address using signing up in AAS is already in the platform, right? That same email address and the wallet, your AAS wallet, right? Those are the two things you need to send. Once you send those two things, we are to push it to the blockchain is two hours. The blockchain will process your payment two hours, within two hours. It will process your payment. Once the system pay you, that account will never exist again. The system will pay you and delete your account. That account will, that email address will never be used in AAS again for life. For life, right? That was how we programmed. And so we didn't program a system that we are holding back a, a, a capital. No, no, no. We only program a system that the capital should be locked. And when you are not interested in trading with AAS, you apply. We will send your email address, send your wallet address to the system. Within two hours, the system will process your payment, same way they are paying you here, and pay to your wallet office. Once that is done in less than a minute, that account will be deleted from the system and that is gone, that is settled for life. That is what we have on board. Sir. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, that is great. Um, we want to quickly jump on the list we have here. We have a lot of hands. Uh, we're going to call the first person that is right here, uh, Mariam Quadri. Mariam Quadri, I will I'll mute you now. And um, please, I want you to go straight to your questions. Not less than one minute. Please, Mariam Quadri, go ahead and uh, ask your question quickly. Mariam Quadri, you are on for your question. I'm sure by now you should be able to work on your mute button. Mariam Hello, Quadri. Good evening. Okay, yes, good, evening. good evening. Yeah, go ahead. That's yes, your question. My question, um, I will appreciate to see you. Well, my question is that it has been asked, but I'm not clear because a lot of people are having an issue with hanging um, funding, as in, because when somebody was asking if um, the website, when the, web, the website shuts down, when do we actually know when to fund? Because when you fund, when the website is attacked or something, you have your phone hanging and all that. I just want to specifically know when you when one can fund so that you won't have problem of website, you know, your, your phone hanging and is not being deposited and all that. That's what I want to ask. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me answer your question. Please uh, pay attention to this. AAS is not an African platform. It's a global platform. We are covering over 70 countries now now 70 over 70 now aas is a global platform it's not just an african platform no it's a global platform now we they, they are teams you are seeing now just as we are seeing them we keep improving on the settings we keep improving on them but listen to this 
You see, when you don't follow rules that govern a game, you'll be stressing yourself and at the same time stressing us. When you want to fund your account, either from Binance, Coinbase, OKEF, Bybit, Hotbit, please, go first to your exchange account, do all of the necessary things, open up, get to the stage where you are to copy one and paste before coming back to your AAS account to tap on deposit, put in the amount, right? Select the wallet, put in the amount, then tap on continue. Don't go to AAS platform, do all of the processing, then you go to your wallet, your exchange wallet to start, no, you mix out. What if your exchange wallet delay to send you SMS code? All the wallet you are bringing in network is delaying. How do you meet up? This is a blockchain transaction. They will wait. Blockchain will never wait for you. Now there is a timer in AAS, and if you didn't meet up with a timer, you will be having issues. Definitely, you are going to have issues. So please, before you fund your account, go to your exchange, move from stage one, stage two to stage three. Stage three is where you are to copy your wallet from AAX account and paste. Once you paste, you tap on it, whereby the same code within the within this space of time, you'll be able to uh, lay, lay hold of the code, put in the code, and confirm your transaction, which will be less than four or five minutes. Please, if you don't follow these rules and you are doing it the way you've been doing, transactions will be handled. You'll be seeing failed. And once you see failed, you're going to stress off. Oh, just as I said yesterday, if you have a failed transaction, we will not attend to you till after 72 hours. Listen again. If you are processing payment and you have a failed transaction and you report the case to me or the admin, I prefer you refer to admin. Because most of you are sending messages to me. I have over 10,000 messages. I've not looked into them. Their workload is much to start looking at messages. Please send to admin. Admin will definitely process it back to us, right? Now, if you send a failed transaction message to admin, we will only attend to you after three days, which is 72 hours. We are human. And do the right thing. You see, if the site is up and running and you do the right thing, you will never see failed transaction. You will never see failed payment. The payment is as fast as just as when you are withdrawing. But when you don't do the right thing and you are expecting the system to perform magic, you will see fail transaction. And fail transaction will take us three good days to attend to you. Then returning back to so when do you suppose to fund? Please listen to this. Uh, two, three days ago, we have a SAC. Our main site was shut down. Other browsers were going. People were funding. The one of today, we decide to shut down because we need to address the issue of the IP address. January, February, March, we know too well our IP address was leaked. We didn't send it out. We didn't copy it out. We didn't open it to the community here, no. But we know it was leaked. Just like we were preparing to attack when the liquidity pool open up, for funding or withdrawing. We were already preparing, waiting for them to attack. Then we will apply for a new IPS address, IP address, right? Now, why we shut down the one of yesterday totally, we need to integrate a new IP address, right? Then with a bigger cyber that will accommodate the global community. We have over 70 countries now in AAS, signing up, funding, and withdrawing over 70 countries. So if we have 70, over 70 countries, we need a bigger cyber. Now, just as the IPS integration is ongoing now, I think I left the deep team, they are doing this. I am here talking to you now, right? A bigger cyber is also being bought to make sure that is in place to serve us. But listen to this, please, please listen to this. Our cyber being down, two, three, four days ago, does not stop you from funding, does not bring in the issue of failed transaction. 
No, you can use any other driver to do this. It will go smoothly, go the funding and we but our own will shut it down if the attack comes in. The one of today, we did it because we are already done with the IP address. So integration is already before the end of today. All of that will be set. The site will be back then. We will return back to business. And listen to this. Those of you who think you are too smart, they don't steal from a thief. It's not possible to steal from a thief. This is what most of you are doing. You will go to your AAS account, tap on the deposit, put in the amount, move down, tap on continue, and cancel the transaction. This is what some of you are doing. Then cancel the transaction. Then going back to your deposit history, you will see failed transaction. Then you copy it and send to me. Hey, my transaction failed. They don't steal from a thief. I am the big good thief. You can't steal from me. It's not possible. Then, please, why not send us your transaction hash? Some of you claim you don't know what's a transaction hash. Why not go to Binance and get it? You say you don't know how to get it. And we won't pay. It's not possible. We can only process your transaction when we see one. You, you need to, when, when you go to the same transaction that you're using paying to see AAS, you tap on it, it will open. Given you up there, you see the wallet that received the money. Below it, you see the transaction hash. You tap on the transaction hash or you copy it or you tap on it. Everything you do about the transaction will be recorded there. Blockchain does not lie. But when you don't give us this, we will never attend to you. Please, when you tap on the transaction hash, use your phone, snap it, then copy it and send to us. Make sure it has the same date, the same time, and the same wallet on me because we will check from our own back end. If the wallet is different, the date is different, the time is different, we won't settle, it will block you. So please, this is what we are doing. Every game has rules that govern it. Play by the rules, follow these few steps, you will hit the top and we'll all celebrate if AAS is there to serve you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, CEO. Um... You will you will you'll be amazed at the number of hands that are that are up here on this list. And also with the few questions that we also have that we've not gone to. So I don't know if it will be proper, CEO, for me to right. to, to right. relegate you to, to two minutes per question. Okay, okay. That so that, that no, no, but I, I'm not saying you should, but I'm trying to say maybe as it's brief right. as you can. Okay, so that we can take more. Sh uh, more question. So uh, I haven't said that I'll be going to um, Sami Show Media. So Sami Show Media, I'll be unmuting you now. And after Sami Show Media, I'll be unmuting Apostle Sam. So once I've taken these two persons, I'll go back to the written questions. So uh, Sami Show Media, you have the right to speak, make it quickly and ask your question. Why Apostle Sam get himself prepared sami show media if you are there quickly we are waiting on you sami show media are you on uh if it's not coming up i'm taking uh apostle sam are you everyone is hearing me right now yes i can hear you sami quickly ask your questions you're welcome on board are you, are you hearing me right now uh we can hear you sami show media okay, go ahead okay, ask okay, your okay, question okay. quickly okay um i want to ask about the compounding um stuff uh yeah the ceo said that the um fund is actually locked in the liquidity pool so when the compounding starts um the boat we have to take the profits and the capital from the um our balance and go back and trade them repeating the process again now since when the fund is locked is it that our profits to also go back with our capital for the trade to come back? And when the trade is coming back, the profit will it be uh, the previous profit plus today's profit altogether? That is what I want to ask about the compound and stuff. Since when our capital is low, or is it that the capital and the profit will come back to our um, funds that we can withdraw it, or is only the profit of the uh, interest plus yesterday interest? I hope we understand. So that is my question. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Sam. Let me answer you. 
uh, when we were programming the system, we have a timer. The timer is to give 15 to 20 minutes withdrawal space, right? That was what we programmed. Now, why you are not seeing 15 to 20 minutes time frame withdrawal now is because the compounding button has not been integrated into the system. It's still pending, right? Waiting when the blockchain open up. That's why I'm forcing you withdraw is your money. The little profit coming in just withdraw is your money. Withdraw my money. You can withdraw and keep it in your wallet if you don't want to fund so that you don't think I'm telling you withdraw and fund. No, no, no. You can withdraw it and keep it in your wallet. It's your money. That is your profit. Your capital is safe. So you can be keeping your profit. You can withdraw fund to make more. That is, a, I call it semi, uh, that's a semi compounding. Now, when we were programming the system, we, we, we gave a room, timer room for withdrawal, which is 15 to 20 minutes, meaning if the system pick up your capital, trade with the capital in the market, return by the next 24 hours, the system will return both profit and capital, and then give room for 15, 20 minutes withdrawal. For example, you want to withdraw, right? You are seeing the profit that you can withdraw. The profit will be there for you. Now, within the space of 15 to 20 minutes, if you don't withdraw, the system will take back, right? There will be a timer. If you check the platform, there, there is timer, timer one and timer two. Timer two, you are seeing now, is reinvestment timer, right? Once that 15, 15 minutes elapsed, the system will take your profit back to the market to the next day again. Now, uh, talking about compounding, Will compounding work? Do we have uh, in mind to implement compounding or to integrate rather? Yes, I believe in compounding. Without compounding, the least person in the team that is investing twenty dollars will not meet up. They won't. It's not possible. My my dream, my vision is not for the rich; it's for the poor. Because I came from a very poor, very poor home. Poor home. I've tested poverty. I've been on the street. I've been homeless. I I know how it look like. So I designed a system to accommodate the list on the street, which is $20. Now, with as low as $20, with a force of compounding in the system, we'll be over $150,000 in, in a year, in 12 months. So I have the interest of the poor masses, the less privileged, the homeless, the widows, the widowers, the orphans, I have all of this. So I believe in compounding. So we build a system to have compounding. But why is compounding not working now? You can't force blockchain. Why is interest not picking up? You can't force blockchain. Now, we are done with all of this. Once the system opens up, already we are preparing to place on the time because we've seen signs already of opening up. Now, from now till this month ending, right? You see the timer. There's compounding time and ripping, right? You see it running in your back office, anywhere you are. Just as you log in, you see it running. Because we've seen sign of the blockchain open up, sign of the blockchain responding, sign of the blockchain. But one funny thing or one crazy thing you must not do is going to force the system called blockchain to work. It will lock you up. And once that happens, you are on your own. You will not get it again. So, guys, these are things we have on ground. Compounding will come up. Increase in uh, percentage will come up. We have all of this in mind. I keep to my wealth. If it's not going to work, I will tell you I won't do it. And there's nothing. I own the system. There's nothing you can do. But I can't do that. I love every one of you. I want the least person in the community to make money. So, guys, get ready. We are working on it, and it's going to work perfectly. Thank you. Over to you, Andrew. Yeah, thank you, C. I think that is very clear enough and uh, understandable. Uh, Apostle, uh, Apostle Sam, uh, if I'm correct, I think I've already given you the possibility to unmute and ask your question. Quickly, after this, then we'll go back to written question, then later we'll come back again. Apostle, I called your All name right. earlier. Okay, go ahead. Ask All a right, uh, good evening, my neighbor CEO. I want to appreciate your good work and for humanity and for the larger world entirely. So God bless you, sir. Now, my question is about internet transfer. It's quite a while now. I actually um, heard that from you. So I want, just want to know, by the time uh, internet transfer would be activated in the system. Now, number one reality which we have come to know from our CEO, the capital is not 
accessible for investors to be able to withdraw. Now, in the case of internet transfer, for instance, maybe I have one or two issues with my already registered account, and um, uh, maybe issue of um, 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 withdrawal wallet or whatever, and I need to move my fund out of that account to a, a new account that I'm going to register. Now, through the help of internet transfer, will my capital be available for me to move from one AS account to another AS account? Or it, it, there is only the profit that is available for withdrawal that will also be available for internet transfer from one AS account to another AS account? Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Sam. Let me answer you, please. Permit me. Uh, this is what we have in mind, and that's what we are going to do. We know a lot of guys have, have made mistakes in their wallets. We are trying to put in their wallet. They put in a different uh, email address, put in a different uh, house number, put in their name instead of their, their withdrawal wallet address. Even those who want to put in withdrawal wallet address, they end up messing it up. So a lot of mistakes in the withdrawal section. The wallet withdrawal section, a lot of these things there. So now, internal transfer is the way out, is the only option to help every one of them that makes this mistake now. Internal transfer is part of our system. Compounding is part of our system. Increasement in percentage is part of our system. Now, once we integrate these three components into the system, this is what is going to happen. Those of you who made mistakes, maybe you are, you, are, you are not ready to uh, be patient with the system, going through internal transfer to move your funds to other accounts, you can apply, right? You can apply for closure of account. Just send us your mail, your wallet address. That is when the system open up, please, not today. You know, some of you are very funny. Just as we close this meeting, you see them sending all. You, you, you'll be amazed if they even list you. Please, list him. Not today, as a system open up for us to integrate these parts that are remaining. You made mistake in your wallet, don't worry, don't have issue. Go ahead with your trading, your trading is ongoing, don't have problem now. It's either you pass to internal transfer, right, to move your funds to a new account you open that you know you have a good wallet, you have the right uh, email address, you have the right phone number, now you can use internet transfer to move money from this account that's already messed up because one, you can edit a wallet. This has been the question everybody is asking, can I edit wallet? No, you can edit wallet. We'll tell you why, you can edit wallet, you can edit email address, and you can edit phone number, why? We didn't build a system that, in case we've been hurt, one will go to edit wallet. No, that was the same we built. No. In case we've been hacked, you can't edit any wallet. The system is closed, like people close. You can't. And for you to go in, it's not possible. So those of you who are asking, why not we edit wallet? If we open that path for you to edit wallet, probably because of your $150. And the liquidity pool is, is big, is growing. And they have access to it. It's just one wallet, not plenty, just one wallet. They will use one wallet and drill the whole thing. So please, no room to edit wallet, no room to edit phone number, and no room to edit email address where you can change your password. If your password is having an issue, we gave room for that, you can easily do that. So please, go back to internal transfer. Yes, internal transfer is part of the plan we have, it's part of the project, just like, Compounding and increasement and increasement in percentage. Those three components are part of us. We must integrate them and they work perfectly. So please be patient with us. You can't force technology, no. I'm learning, I'm a student, and I want to learn more. What I am seeing in AAS, no lecturer would have taught me this. No programmer, no programmer on earth would have taught me this. But the blockchain being a teacher, the grandmaster, is teaching. And I'm learning, I'm learning, I'm processing it. Version 2.0 being the mother of all wizards. <laughs> Tell these guys, I came prepared. Ambrose, over to you, over to you.
Thank you. <laughs> thank, 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 thank. <laughs> Thank you very much to you. That was very uh, quick. Uh, right about now, we have about 3,638 participants on this call. That is huge. We appreciate you for coming on board. And I uh, believe uh, you guys are having a sweet time enjoying this uh, AMA session like never before. I want to still quickly remind you again before we jump up to other questions that um, our social media platforms are all uh, present in our back in our program room uh you please can use the uh the link tree that we have there and connect to every of our social media platforms and we also have a provision for a backup room for the telegram room in case of any in case it uh, we know telegram have not been friendly to us should they knock us out anytime we wouldn't have to start looking for you we'll have you on the second backup community so if you are not aware yet please screw through the pinned messages in our rooms and you're going to get yourself fixed up with that so i want to quickly let you have that in the uh, back of your mind so back again to this very wonderful ama having a wonderful ceo with us taking time to really answer our questions as a father uh, we do to uh his children so there's a tone you always use there is um, a language you always say as a good husband so now many spartans who happen to be your wives which means you have so many wives. So they want to bring you back again to your promises to your wives that you told them that uh, you will be giving us a 5% bonanza uh, for 90 days in order for you to make up for the uh, the time delay during the beta testing. And uh, with these challenges we are having here and there and the system not opening up uh, the blockchain, will we ever have this opportunity to enjoy this 5%? Or is it also going to be dependent on till when the blockchain open up before we start enjoying this 5% for that 90 days? See you. Okay, thank you. Thanks, Andrew. Ah, you see, I keep to my words. And in AAS, we keep to our promises. 1.56% to 2% to 2.3% to 5%. You can't play with you see this is not politics we are not trying to play politics here this is not conventional business that you tell people a and do b no integrity is at stake there are things you don't do it has nothing to do with the color either you are white or you are black no you don't tell people a and go and do b no if you tell them a do the a if we do this, the world will be a better place for everyone of us, either to the white or to the black. It was a promise. Let it me alone. <laughs> I want you to be so rich. Let it. Let it me alone. I want you to be super rich, very, very rich. I want you to have financial freedom. Why would I be making money and you're not making money? Does that make sense? It does not speak well of me. It does not. Fill an account of $250,000 trading. Ooh, <laughs> that is money. That is crazy money. I want you to trade with the same account. If a member can trade with this, you can. It's possible. So when we talk about percentage, as a good husband, it was a promise. But when you are trying to integrate that part and the system wipe it off, you come back, the system wipe it off, you come back, it wipe it off, it locks off. You need to respect yourself. This is blockchain, it's not Ponzi platforms. So what do we do? We need to return back. Okay, let's follow either way it is, wiping out, wiping out, returning back to 1.6. Okay, let's return back to 1.6. Now we are operating with 1.6. But listen to this, there's something I want you to know. Your bank does not pay you 1.6. Most companies you are giving your money to, they don't pay you 1.6. AAS is a sure banker. AAS is not going anywhere tomorrow. What we have is a 100 million blockchain user capacity, 100 million. And before we get to that 100 million, our blockchain will be ready. The job is ongoing. The liquidity pool, AAS. Liquidity will be ready. AAS stable coin will be ready. We won't even get close to that 100 million user capacity before our blockchain will be ready. Now, but when you want to force the system to work, 
Because if you were a promise to the community, what is the system lock us out? We won't be here, you won't be trading, you won't trade. You need to wait. That means we'll be going to deploy a new blockchain and that will take us months to fill the work. But here we are, the system is opening up. The first part of it is to push in immediately the compounding. Because I want you to double your money, I want you to make more money. Once that is stabilized, then we'll push in the percentage. This time we won't push two, three, four, five. No, we, we have learned my lesson. We won't even try it. We'll push two, we'll push 3.2, then we'll push five. And now the five is not just going to be for 90 days. No, it's not going to be for 30 days, for 20. No, the five, the way we program it this time, it will hit five, pay members of five, and return back, right? Return back, right? Pick up two, pick up three, pick up five, pay members with five, and return back. So on its own, I don't need to be there. I don't need to force it. I don't need to do anything to force it. The system is already programmed to rotate it. Guys, there are a lot of, there are a lot of futures we are pushing in. It's not everything I'll be telling you here. Oh, with you present here, you will be seeing it, you will be seeing it, and you keep seeing it growing. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, uh, that is also uh, sharp and quick. Uh, let's quickly also jump on this other question. Uh, this is from uh, Higher Ground. That is what is the username is, Higher Ground. Uh, higher Ground is saying that um, I have the issue of pending withdrawals for my AAS account since the 5th of this month. Since on the 5th of this month, he has been having a pending withdrawal. So his question is, when will this issue of pending withdrawal be fixed? Now, let me answer you. Thank you. Thank you, uh, the issue of pending withdrawal. Now, when we have pending withdrawal issue, we ask everybody, please send us your email address, right? Once you send your email address, we'll go into the system. To check why you haven't sent in withdrawal and whitelist it immediately, it will hit your account. Those of you who are members, you can attest to this. Now, if yours is up to six days, who did you communicate with? Who do you send your email address to? Please, those of you who are very good in sending your email address to your offline, most of your offline will block them. They are scammers, they are yahoo yahoo, they are fraudsters. They are not telling you that most of them will know them from their own telegram room the second we know that we'll be following them we have their leads right so once they come up to start acting like 10 who we'll block them they won't be telling you that now probably you send your email address to them they don't know who to report to because all of their doing they have their leads so by the time you come your name is on the wanted list who will you communicate with nobody so please uh, uh just as we close this meeting please don't send your email address to anybody right send it to ambrus here Andrew, the coordinator send the email address to ambrus here ambrus will send to me i will look into that issue and it will be settled in few seconds mm -hmm. thank you thank you okay that's a quick one i'll take another one again from a spartan taller uh taller uh, her own is, um, she said, two sisters, which is happened to be her downline, and they put money together to uh, to raise the, the the minimum required for beta testing, and they were able to fund the account. And the intention was that once beta testing starts and they start trading, uh, they make money, then with the profit, they will open a second account for the other person, since there were two who put money together. Now his question is, uh, will it still be possible especially now that there is no internal transfer if the internal trans, uh, transfer has been activated integrated can they still have the possibility of you know sharing this money in their in uh, through the internal uh, provision in their back office so that the other person can have his account running if you understand this question see you i do thank you the, she has she has a question and she has even answered her own very question. I don't need to answer that, but let me help you out again. Now, were you planning to share the profit while at the capital, while trading, or the capital was already trading? Definitely, it's from the profit now, you are going to make the remaining $500, then you share. It's simple. The system is trading with the current $500, 
making daily profit, why not withdraw and have a wallet? Just have a wallet. Just as a system trader and return the daily profit, for now, compounding is not ongoing, except to you withdraw a payback, which is semi compounded. Now, whatsoever the system return is on the dashboard, you are seeing the profit per day. Now, if by the end of the day, or by the end of the week, or by the end of the month, because it takes about 40 something days to double up an account. Now, if in 47 or 48 working days, the account is being doubled, you can take it off. Or you do daily withdrawal. If you don't trust AAS to keep that money for you, do daily withdrawal. The system pay back, withdraw either to your 20 stack wallet account. Yeah, you'll be doing that. Once it gets to 500, that means you settle that, right? I think not just only you, I have so many persons who are sharing accounts, right? In better testing. I think even among my admin, right? So many of them, they do the same sharing. So this is the method they are applying. So you don't need to wait for internal transfer to do this. You don't need to wait for the capital uh, to close the account of the capital for you to do it. No, the we try, so you just leave it up there to file up. Once it gets to 500, then you push to your twin sister account and everybody starts from there. Thank you. Okay, yeah, thank you, see you. I'll take one, uh, two questions in one now, then I will come back again to the people on live to take questions from them. I want you to take note of these two questions one I want to take. Uh, somebody wants to know, I think it's also this guy, Allah. This Allah, if I, we have to know him, we have to pay me because the question he asks are so, so much, but they are important anyway. I took time to bring them out and uh, try to paraphrase them. So I'm coming back to his question again. He said, um, will eternal transfer also be having daily limit by the time he's integrated? Will it also be having daily limit? If yes, how much daily limit will it be? Internal transfer. Then uh, the second question I will take alongside with it, see from him, he said, why is top up taking between 48 to 72 hours before being added to the investment capital for trading? Is there any solution you are planning for top up to be taken within 24 hours? See you. Thank you. Thank you. Now, uh, withdrawal is a withdrawal. If you go to your Binance account and Binance said a daily withdrawal of uh, a verified account in Binance is about $8 million, right? Now, will it be because you have another second Binance account, then you want to move, that is internal transfer. Will Binance give you the room to move above $8 million? The answer is no, they won't. Transfer is transfer. Either to a TANA wallet or it's transfer. Now, the issue of uh, 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 10,000 withdrawal limit, we, we see who will we, 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 we overcome it, who we'll work over it. Hmm? We'll definitely apply. The community is so massive that present, I'm not comfortable with $10,000. No, I'm not. Yesterday, I've sold all of my to tokens. Tokens are set for years. I can't go there. I wiped them out yesterday all. To make sure I have a big account that I can trade with. I want to trade like you. I, the issue of sit as the CEO, those of you who are, are spying our system, go in, check very well. There is no CEO withdrawal wallet. Check. There is no profit withdrawal wallet in AAS. There is no, it's not there. Binance didn't give that rule because I don't want to manipulate system. I am a trader like you. I want to make money from AAS. I want to go through the pain. You will go through the trauma, the disappointment. I want to go through them so that I can fix the system. When you are complaining, I can fix them. I'm just on the same path with you, but working on the system. Right? So, internal transfer, the limit will still remain $10,000. Yeah. Okay. Once Binance say, okay, we are moving you to $50,000, to $100,000, or to unlimited, you apply before now. Good. But for now, Binance is a holding that part. And they want to see how the community will cooperate, what we are up to, what we need to do. Are we frosters? Do we have a community uh, 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 in mind to make sure nothing goes on? Then they will keep improving the system. Then let me answer this other question as well. I know a lot of you want to ask this question. When you are transferring your money, do AAS charge you? The answer is capital no. AAS, from the one I told you, 
we won't charge you. Binance is in charge of payment, not AAS. Those of you who were in the room here last week uh, when we did the last uh, AMA, I dropped a screenshot here of Binance API withdrawal approval. Binance does the payment, not even Jeff and Michael. Binance give approval of payment, not Jeff and Michael. Do your findings. Just look at that document. He still that thing up. I've seen that document. Just go through it. If you don't understand, send it to anybody who understands how Binance withdraw payment, API withdrawal payment will work. They will tell you this is it. Now, when you place a withdrawal, that one dollar you are seeing is Binance, not AAS. I didn't put profit withdrawal or CEO withdrawal from now till 90 days or 100 days. Is when we will be planning on how we are going to start withdrawing a payment of my co founder. The office in US, I am the one paying for my pocket. The furniture, the furniture is ongoing now by Saturday. Everything about the furniture in US will be set, the office will be set for work cooperation. It's expensive. I'm paying for my pocket, not even from. There's no pay coming from AAS. Why? Because I want to operate with integrity. I want to be disciplined. I don't want Binance to look at me as if because I'm a black guy, then I have hunger for money. No, I kill that part, and I don't want that part to come up. So, so those of you are fine, this is a check very well. There is no profit withdrawal, withdrawal in AA as that COO is taking. No, I don't do that. It's not a time. You give the system 90 to 100 days, operate, buy, sell, make profit, accumulate more. So that once the percentage of 2% comes in, 3% comes in, 5% comes in, we won't have issue. We won't. So we pile up more, we gather more, we save more, because the raining days are always there. So we need to prepare for the raining days. So AAS is not charging $1, please. AAS is not charging that. It's Binance. Binance is in charge of withdrawal of funds. Binance is in charge of withdrawal of funds again. Binance is in charge of withdrawal funds, not AES. They authorize withdrawal. Thank you. Thank you, Ambrose. Yeah, thank you, uh, CEO. That was also very quick. Uh, yeah, you know, like uh, one or two quickly, I'll uh, say to what you just said. When you talk about uh, you as a person also want to be a trader of the platform, at the same time to go through the pains and the challenges uh, traders go through, I think that is a very correct fact because I remember in authenticating this that uh, the last time I had issues with my own account that uh, my top up wasn't picked after I think 24 hours running to 48 hours and I contacted you and the next answer you gave to me was to also send me your own account showing me that your own has not also picked. So in my mind, I would say, wow. I thought that of CEO, the blockchain will recognize CEO and quickly take your own. So wish me we are all in the same boat. So I think that is a perfect uh, way to set up a system. So we want to say thank you again very much for that. I'm coming now again to the people right here on live. I want to give you the opportunity to ask your questions and please try to make it brief and very sharp. And uh, we have over 3,000 for 45 participants presently. So I'm looking for a lady to call. I want to be very, very fair. I think I have a name called Virtuous Lady. I just hope you are a lady. But if you are not a lady, man, I think you've just deceived me. So Virtuous Lady, I'll give you the opportunity to speak and ask your question. That is your username here, Virtuous Lady. Go ahead and ask your yes, question. Good evening. Thank you. Thanks for your Thank God she's a lady. You're welcome. Yes, I'm a lady. Good evening, Justin Michael. God bless you. Virtuous Lady, you're welcome. Yeah, please. Um, I want to ask... And the question about um, closing of account. Now you said if you want to withdraw, um, you, I don't even I don't even like that word closing account. If there was if there was another way, people can have access to there. Some of, some of my people will even ask me that is there any way we can even have half, or you just want to withdraw something from your capital but not all. Not just by closing the account. That is one. If there's any way we can, they can have access to part of their capital, the way it's going, I don't think they can. But if there is, please, I want to know that. And again, now he said if they want to really close their account, they have to go through um, the admin. Now, because of the workload, I'm, I'm trying to look at if, let us say, there's so many, because you already have a lot on your table. Now, going through an admin, and a lot of people going through an, an admin, 
I feel it's the workload will be so much. I was feeling if in the website, there's a way we can interact with the website. If you really want to close your account, there's a button you can click and immediately you get it at your back end. And it can be like, you know, we said two hours, blah, blah, then it can be done by just clicking a button in your website and going through the admin. Now what I'm saying, going through the admin, like if I don't come on the platform and tag an admin, please, because now you know how Telegram works. Telegram is basically um, restricting a lot of people from even conversing. I if I want to like okay. Okay. chat and admin, I mean, it kind yeah. of restricts me. So it, if there's any way, because a lot of people cannot even chat. Yeah, your question, so your question is clear. Interact, your question yeah, is clear, first yeah, lady, yeah, for the sake of time. Yeah, yeah. You. you're you. welcome. Thank okay, you. okay, see you. Let, let me ask you. You see, the issue of create a room where we can tap on. <laughs> I wish you see what I'm seeing. I wish you'll be with me for one hour when the attack starts to see what is happening. You will never talk again. You'll be so happy that we close all loopholes to make sure they don't come in from the back side, the back door, the front door. No, we close them. You see, I just made my 18 years. Four days ago, I made my 18 years trading FX. And I made it 11 years, four days ago, holding crypto. In the crypto space, I'm 11 years old. In the FS industry, I am 18 years old now. I've seen the bad, the good, the ugly. I've seen systems that were so powerful, recognized global recognition, more than AAS. But because they didn't close these loopholes, those guys make mess of them. They finish them. The last one here, every one of you know it, I don't want to call the name. That guy came out from COTPS. He made so much money from COTPS. So much money. He was a co-founder with COTPS. Just as they had their issue, he broke out and opened his own. An arbitrage platform, nice platform, it was okay. These things we are asking for, he gave room for them. He did not run to the blockchain because he was in a hurry to gather COTPS crowd for himself. He hosted a platform in the cloud. They hacked in. What did he say? He said, FBI invited him. I told, I, I told my adult, I said, who's FBI? Look at, he hacked him. They, they messed him up. They lay hold of his liquidity pool. He's off. He's out of business. He's not FBI. He's not. A business as he's 21 days. He's not FBI. Look at, look at, he's been hacking. See, 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 hacking. See, these guys, they are not your friends. They are your enemies for life. Their interest is a fund, the liquidity pool. By the time we play an open field game where your capital is placed in the open field, whereby you want to withdraw, you want to take out your capital, part of your capital, you tap on the button, we think few have come to you. If these guys come, that is already loopholes. We won't be talking. Imagine we have loopholes yesterday night. Some of you by now you will be calling FBI, Infapo, EFCC. By now, you won't even believe me that they hack us. You won't. See, thank God for wisdom and oppression. Thank God that we close all of this. Thank God we we'll build and lift. Really, people have put the company to lock the blockchain and throw up the key. Renounce it and walk away. Just thank God for it. Now, by the time it's okay, let us create this room that you are looking for. You want to take part of your capital, you tap. That means we are going to have our capital in a hot wallet, whereby the robotic system go to the hot wallet and do the transaction, do the payment, do all of the work, right? Do all of the trading. Or you want us to build a system that looks like that is a royal queue. No, 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 no. That is normal trading platforms. From the front end, no. You can't build a system, a massive system, that you want to chop the world from the front end, no. That means if the market go against your robotic system, then the robot will wait. Then when the market recover to the entry point, then the robot will make profit. No, you can't meet up. You need to trade from the back end. This is what you don't understand. AAS is not trading from the front end, no. No. We are trading 
from the bank. We only hire the API of the F team and build our own and we'll pass to the back end and do our business. You can't hold us, it's not possible. So please, I beg you all in the name of God, we tell you understand what I do. We tell those of you who are insulting me, abusing me, calling me all sorts of names, we tell your eyes will open. If what we build, if we let the money in the open field, hosting our program in the cloud, because if you leave the money in the open field, Binance will never grant liquidity pool. They will never, they will never give it to you. You can't build a system to host in the cloud and you're applying for Binance. So no, you must run it in the blockchain for Binance to give you liquidity pool. All blockchain, no liquidity pool. So for now, you don't understand what we build. You don't understand the model we came up with. You don't understand the ideology that is playing behind AAX. We we try your eyes open. So we give you the system that you want your capital, you start no, If you want your capital, you apply. Just as you are, just as you apply, we will take your email address, take your wallet, and send to the blockchain within two seconds. Two hours the system will pay you within two seconds. It will close up your account. That account will never exist again. That was what we build. Why? I don't want you to call FBI to arrest me. I don't want you to call Interpol to arrest me. I don't want you to call EFCC to arrest me. Because if we give room for hackers to come in like yesterday, by now, my name will be everywhere on the internet. It should not be because of your hundred dollars. Then we will risk over twenty, thirty, forty thousand dollars, hundred thousand dollars, one million dollars, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty million dollars. No. Think now, please give all the room to serve you better. If we serve you better, You'll be happy doing business with me. We have a long way to go. Our liquidity pool is coming up. Our blockchain is coming up. Our own token, table code token, is coming up. Give me the room to serve you better. Not from what you think, but from what we know. We know them, they know us. We close the gate. Don't ask me to open the gate. If you are not ready to do business with me, apply for your capital. Chicken. I love you. But that was all that. I love you. Nah, I'm not, but I will never open the door to be happy. I love you. Yeah, that's that's great. That's great. Thank you. And I'm sure that was well gotten. Uh yeah, I'm going to call on you now. My used one. That is your username. My used one. I will give you the opportunity now to unmute yourself. And then uh, we're going to Richie after the Richie, then we take Uzo easy. So my used one. So you go ahead, unmute yourself, and quickly ask your question. Then after that, we'll come to Richie. Then after Richie, we'll go to Easy. My used one. Okay, go ahead. Ask your question quickly. Hello, good evening. Can you hear me? Sure, loud and clear. Go ahead, please. Okay. I'm waiting for you. Please go ahead, ask your question. Yes, I want to ask now. I, w I want to ask the boss about the security. Now, the security of the site. I noticed that he said that when the site goes off, the trades are still going on, on behind the scene and the returns on investment are still coming in. Now, my question is, when this site will be is attacked in subsequent times because we now know this attacker will always come we always come now when the site is being attacked is there anything that the boss is doing to keep the site to start running again within 24 hours of attack is there any uh, possible chances because or are we going to buy another ip when the attack again or something like this then we have to be waiting, keep buying IPs. Is there anything the boss is doing to make sure that the site can come up, come up without going Your to spend money? Is okay. It's okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me answer you. You see, we have so many Ponzi platforms. Nobody's attacking them. So many. So my week old, two weeks old, three months old, six months old, nobody, nobody's attacking them. Even the one that was competing with uh, <laughs> the same, they are using $50 to do, do their test running. 
Are you still in the attack? Hey, unethical. <laughs> they attack what is real. What is real, what is real, not what is fake. Because they knew where the money is. They go for their back. Their back money is where the interest is. Now, when you talk about, uh, is there any way out? Nothing is wrong with our platform. It's for our interest and for our good that if they come to attack, the system shuts itself down. And that does not affect the cyber or holding the robotic system for the trading. No, it does not affect it. See, is this a thing I want you to know? Like you tell your followers, interpret it better to them, or use a better language to communicate properly to the, with them. Hey, the attack coming into AAS cyber does not affect the robotic system trading in the cyber. I tell you, we have so many cybers operating with AAS. You attack cyber one, cyber two is still operational. You attack cyber two, cyber three is still operational. You attack cyber four, five is still operational. You attack six, seven is still operational. So it does not affect our trading. Your duty is to attack. Hey, AAS is a global platform. If I am not seeing this attack, I won't be happy. Sincerely, sincerely. If these attacks were not coming in, then that means the, globe, the global unethical, the global hackers, that means they are not seeing anything good with my platform. I'll be wondering, that means I need to go back and build a platform that will check them to wake up. But here we are, AAS is a global platform, the global hackers, they understand, they know. When they see the real platform, they know. They don't run after shadows. They go after reality. They know what they are doing. So now, are we going to start changing IP address? No, listen, see, listen, listen. When you build a system from day one to a finishing touch, by right, we are supposed to change our IP address after a month of operation, a month. White list it and get another one moved, um, right? Let me, let me open up, let me open up so that let me digest it. Now, the truth is that we have to run 789 cyber, right? And uh, it takes 30 working days, 25 to 30 working days for a hacker to uh, redesign or look at what you have to attack, right? Now, and what we have on, on ground is every 14 days, move out of cyber one to cyber two. I don't know if you're there. The next 14 days, move out of two to three. So when they are building what they want to attack in cyber one, you're already out of two, you are in three. So by the time you are preparing to attack three, you're already in five. So they are attacking two empty. That is what is happening to them now. We didn't come to trade well. If you look at me, I'm not a grammarian. I don't know how to trade words. I don't know. I don't even know. I can't speak very well. Can you hear my English? A layman English. I don't know how to trade words. We came very prepared. We came prepared to face them. So by right, after 30 days of operation, we're supposed to kind of white lizard and integrate a new, uh, uh, put up a new uh, uh, settings of a new IP address, set it up and integrate the system. But it came very early. We need to do it fast, right? Now, we are not operating with one, two, three, four, five cybers. We are operating with multiple cybers. So if you are attacking here, the robotic system, the cyber holding the robotic system is there. And the cyber holding AAS is there. And the funny part of it is that the host <laughs> is like, I, 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 okay, let me, let me set an example. Uh, 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 you, uh, you bought uh, uh, your cyber with GoDaddy and you host with GoDaddy. They would have finished us. We spent so much. We bought with GoDaddy, but we hosted somewhere else. I won't call the name. Because they are here, they are watching, they are listening. We host it somewhere. So by the time you, you are hitting the door of gold that we, where we bought our cyber, we are not there. We can't prepare to make mess of you. Anyway, leave those guys. Let's face business. Let's not just face business. Let's face business. Yeah, see you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Uzo, Eze, I think you already have uh, the possibility of uh, muting yourself. Uzo, Eze. Go ahead, ask your question. If you are still here with us, I've given you that opportunity long ago. Uzo Eze, are you there? Because we really don't have time to waste. Uh, Why Uzo is trying to get Hello? himself ready? Hello? Yeah, go are ahead you? and ask your question, Uzo. 
Okay, okay. please see you. Please, I want to go to internal transfer again. My downline now, one of my downline has made a mistake in his phone number. He put zero there instead of putting seven starting. So the other number uh, couldn't come in. So now he's now working on internal transfer, maybe hoping when internal transfer comes up. Now, now what I'm asking now, when Twilo is inculcated in the system, eh, will there be SMS code? Will there be need for SMS code? For internal transfer to go, or will an uh, 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 email could be needed? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Uzo. Please, this is what you need to do. Eh? Just as the account come off of, of, of level, close that account, open a new account. I'll tell you why. Now, why we not integrate a Twilo SMS into the platform is because we want to see how everybody can operate freely for now. See when the system stabilizes, right? We can then push in uh, that of Twilo. Now, when you are doing internal transfer, are you aware Twilo will still send SMS to be sure that you are the owner of that account? Definitely, they will send SMS because just as you tap on uh, internal transfer, they will tell you put in your username, put in the email address, put in the amount, right? Then your phone number, same phone number, put in your phone number. Just as you tap on it, the system will send you an SMS because the system wants to be sure that you are the owner of the account. If not, anybody can uh, log into your account and start withdrawing without you knowing you come up the next day, your account is empty without an SMS code going to your phone. So please, if the account come of age, right, the best thing you need to do is apply. We will help you, right? Move the phone, right? Then you shut down that account and open a new account that you, you are sure the phone number is correct, the phone number is okay, the email address is okay, then the withdrawal wallet is okay, right? So please, let's do it that way. Thank you. Okay, um, I'll take it the last hand that I'm seeing here. Um, maybe other hands will come up later. Marvel, uh, by the name Marvel, Marvel, go ahead. Unmute yourself and uh, ask your question as quickly as possible. Marvel, okay. you are next. Thank you. Yeah, I'm here. Sure. So thank you very much for such a gathering like this. It's a very, very great honor to, you know, meet you guys and be here. So straight to the question. People like me, we use VPN with the purpose on the internet. So my question is, can we or can I use VPN to assess AAS or does AAS come with an anti-VPN that kicks you off just like ClickBank do or does when someone uses VPN to assess the size? So does AAS come with an anti-VPN robot system or can I or can we, you know, have access to the system using VPN? Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Now, if we give room for B VPN, we'll be messed up. Those of you who are trying to use it and log in, you discover anytime you want to log in, the system will just log you out. Log you out, right? Log you out. Why? We are conscious of security. If there's anything I want to do, see, when I will get old with AAS, is security. Let's be sure the phones are safe. Usernames are saved, email addresses are saved, <laughs> are saved. Whatsoever we want to do in the system here, we must be sure of security. Without security, AAS will not, will not. You need to see what happened yesterday. If we give room for all of this, you are saying, we'll be out of business. But here we are. Trading are still ongoing. Return on investment are dropping. Few hours from now, we'll be done with all of the settings. And once the settings are done, you can log in and see by yourself that the, the, the try happen is not possible. The try coming in is not possible. The system shut down. We do adjustment because the more they try to hack us, the more we see loopholes in our system, then we adjust and close. Anytime the system shut down, it gives, okay, just look at that screenshot I drop in the morning. That was a clear message that they came in, right? Can you read it yourself? They came in. It shut itself up. 
Then what do we do? This is what you need to do. The system will report to you what you need to do. So in accordance with the message, we comply. And here we are today. So please, most of those things we won't give. If we give room to them, we'll be messed up. Those guys are not smiling. They are just after the mistake people. So please, let's close. Let's close those loopholes. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, CEO. Uh, in, I think in uh, in, in actual case uh, vpn actually may not really be necessary for anyone who wants to come clean uh, normally vpn is uh, made available for uh, people in a country whereby you are restricted from ac oh, access okay. certain website so if for you to be able to assess it if that website is really valuable to you then you use a vpn in order to bypass the security if not uh, you don't need it on AS. Just come clean and uh, we'll see you directly and you are okay with us. Uh, quickly, 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 I uh, will ask this question. Let me see if they see a hand up. Okay, let me take one hand up. Uh, then I go back to question we have on ground. I want to take Willy for real. Willy for real, I'll give you that po a possibility now to unmute yourself and ask your questions. Willy for real, you are allowed to speak and ask your question. I think you are not responding. I don't know why. Willy for real. No way it's not going. Uh, let me take uh, Tabeta. Tabeta, you can go ahead and ask a question. Tabeta. Okay, I don't know why. Uh, the system is telling me you cannot talk. Okay, fine. Let me quickly go to a uh, question we have here. Maybe there's a setting you put on on your side. Two of you, I try unmuting you, but the system is returning to me that you cannot talk. I uh, see you. There's a question here we have in our list. Um, I think this one is coming from NAD, N A R O D. Um, for those people who have, because we have a series of these. Uh, um challenge also with us uh, in our dm from some of us uh, spartans and uh, then mistakenly you know in some wallet ceo especially like binance you have the privilege of whitelisting your address that you want to send things to for for more security and some people at the very first day they deposited in as so some of them whitelisted the address thinking that is going to be one address deposit address for life not knowing that our address changes so now the problem is many of these people some of them have sent pop up to that same address that initial address they used to um fund aas not knowing that another address has been generated so with these people will there ever be any form of help for them in the nearest future like for example those that have failed the transaction you are offering a kind of 72 hours for them to be for attendant to be given to them but these people in this category who missed who sent consistently deposit to initial address would there ever be a possibility of uh, hope for them to get their fund in the nearest future see you thank you thank you please see if you haven't that issue this is what you need to do just hold on right be patient with us the workload is much. We are trying our possible best to make sure we meet up. More settings are ongoing. Just as you are laying your complaints, we are resetting them. Yeah, we're having a challenge in uh, the CEO network. Uh, we hope um, you'll be coming back again to us as quick as possible. Um, We've uh, had yeah. a little. Uh, okay, yeah, it's, it's back. Well, Andrew, go ahead. Yeah, yeah go ahead. Uh, it's, You're back. it's a global platform, right? Those issues are about to come in. But what we need to do is uh, listen to their complaints, sit down, set them, make sure we are all uh, uh, doing the right thing for the community. Now, if you're having that issue of uh, sending a uh, form to same wallet, what you need to do is this make sure you have a transaction hash of that transaction of that uh, uh, payment right I have a transaction hash then do a screenshot of it then uh, be on hold if the system come up all of these issues are being settled right then we'll tell you to send them please to ambrose right let ambrose handle that so that i can remember on time a lot of work on ground so you send it to ambrose once ambrose send it to me please be specific right 
this, 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 so that when we are going into the system, we know, okay, this is the issue having because money does not got lost in the blockchain, right? Then we we'll look into it. If truly you did transfer, then we we'll look for a way out. Let's read that way. Okay, thank you uh, very much, see you. Uh, let me scatter through again. Uh, I think this is a very uh, uh, serious allegation question here that I would need your attention. Uh, it's hovering around already, also in the internet, and uh, some bloggers and also YouTubers have been piloting this around, saying that uh, uh, some of um, through this payment of address that we've got gotten as a result of uh, making uh, withdrawals, that uh, they have been able to trace some of our account that is paying them to be an account that is uh, connected to COTP, COTPS. And uh, one of the accusations uh, that is going on right there, uh, they identify a wallet that start with TS, TNX and ended with uh, 32, 32G and uh, claim that that wallet belongs to AAS and that that wallet has transferred the sum of 279 million, now 907,000. 559 and 322 cents USDT to a wallet that is uh, started with TWD and ended with uh, 5JWB and claim that wallet belongs to COTP. So uh, they accuse us that uh, we uh, as AAS are running an affair uh, with uh, COTPS on the background. So uh, I don't know how you want to respond to this uh, uh, unnecessary or what would I call <laughs> an allegation that is drawing attention right now by bloggers uh, and those who are naysayers. See you. Okay. Okay, I'm Bruce. Thanks. Thanks for, uh, thanks for the energy you have there. Let it me alone. I won't even answer it, but for the sake of our community, we need to clear that issue. I've seen it. Some send it to me. I blog them. Now, if you look at that wallet, right, tap on that contract wallet, it has $444,000,000. 872 million, bra 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 bra. Now, the liquidity pool of AEX is not up to $1 billion. Talk more, 444 billion. Even if you are blind, AAS is not up to two weeks yet. It's just a week plus. Even if you are blind, see, they are blind argument you don't engage into. We are just a week plus. Our liquidity pool it's not up to 100 billion, it's not up to 200 billion, it's not up to 300 billion, it's not up to 444 billion dollars. It's not. Even if you are blind, you can see. If you can't see, let them help you and see. If you tap on that smart contract wallet, it's holding up over 400 billion dollars. Do we have up to that? No, we don't. Now, you see, one funny thing with life is if they come up with this lie, you prove they're wrong, they will move to another stage again, form under lies, you prove they're wrong, they, they will keep looking for lies upon lies upon lies. For God's sake, AAS cannot use COTPS wallet for payment. It's not possible. These are two different companies. AAS is coming up to see how tech work, what just and view. They are, they will come up to see what I do. I told you, one of their support, the guy worked with them, we met in Turkey, right? He's one of their support. He's here, he's here with us. He's trading with us. I don't know if he's in this meeting. He's here with us. We have no business with COTPS. We are not related to COTPS. We have respect for COTPS because COTPS remains the mother platform that opened the eye of everyone about arbitrage trading. So we can't talk her down. No, you don't do that. You don't talk people down because they are on their downside. No, you don't do that. Or because they are going through challenges. No, you don't do that. COTPS build technology. But then their eyes are not really open to see what we are seeing today. We build a tech to face war. They build tech to make money from the market and pay to members. We build tech to have one of the latest security, they consider security 20-30%. We consider security 100% because I know I'm going to face a lot. I talk a lot. They know they're coming to attack me because I'm telling them to their face, so they will come. 
So I consider security. I didn't leave our phone in a hot wallet. COTPS left their phones in a hot wallet, build the back end robot, the front end robot and front end robot to trade from the hot wallet to pay to members. No, we left our phones in the liquidity pool. These are two different operations. And Binance authorized our payment. That's why they are taking that charges you are seeing. Binance authorized us. Binance did not authorize the payment of COTPS. No, these are two different operations. So the wallet in question, the smart contract wallet in question, uh, has over $400 billion. Our liquidity pool is not up to $100 billion. So how is that coming from COTAS? With all due respect, I respect COTPS. They know what they are doing. We keep praying for them to recover. It's easier to build, but once it crashes, to pack back, to pick back the pieces and build his head. His head. Just remember when we went through, we were trying to build this library of the, of, of the robotic. Three good months. Imagine that just 5% of a job took three months. Then imagine what COTPS is going through. We have respect for them, but we are not using COTPS wallet for payment. That contract address has over $400 billion. Our liquidity pool is not up to $100 billion. We are just a weak clause. So please disregard those information. Those things are lies. They are not true. And those of you who want to see our liquidity pool. <laughs> boy, oh boy. I, I can't prepare. I will be the one to show you the liquidity pool. Leave those things you are bulldozing. Just leave those smart contracts you are tapping here. Leave those things. Hey, when a thief builds a bank, he builds it's very secure because I know the government will wake up for tax. I didn't give room for open placement. I didn't do that. I'm a thief. I keep telling you, I'm a thief, a good thief, not a bad thief. So leave my you can't see my liquidity without my permission. It's not possible. I will be the one to direct you to copy and paste. I'll tell you, see the balance. This is how it looks like. Those things they are running, those things are it's shady. They don't know what they are doing. Just leave them. Let's pick up our business and look. I'm, I'm Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much, CEO. I think that was a well, dis a well, uh, brilliant way to dispel that rumor. And I believe Spartan in the house would rather believe uh, what they hear from the horse's mouth than what is flying out there. Because really, a lot of people are out to dissuade us morally, emotionally, in wherever way they can, and physically. Then we must be ready to also despair. Uh, thank you very much again, CEO. Right now, we are almost. Uh, uh, one hour, 50 minutes, 10 minutes uh, away from two hours on this call. I can't imagine CEOs standing, responding to question at this hour. And we have uh, uh, over 3,377 Spartan still ready and present listening and enjoying this hour. I want to really thank everyone that has made this possible. And we know fully well that uh, we are in for something so, so good. I want to take one more question from the question we have right there in the list, then I'll come back again. Uh, to the life, uh, um, I'm out to see people who have questions here. Yeah, see you from um, Al Al Aloysius. Aloysius, forgive me if I pronounce the name wrong. Aloysius. Uh, apart from him, also there are other patterns also who must have also complained about this. The issue is, uh, see you that um, in their back office they could actually see the activities of trading. They see the daily uh, earning history dropping. But right on the dashboard, they don't see uh, the the data as of what those daily earnings have accumulated to. It's not displayed. But when they go into the menu and click on any and daily earnings, they will see everything that is being earned on daily basis. But it doesn't reflect on the dashboard. So how will this be handled? Is there a solution, CEO? Thank you. Thank you, Ambrose. Uh, the trading ongoing. Is from the back end and the platform they are looking at the, the dashboard they are looking at is a dummy dashboard a dummy uh, a page right that communicate to them right that their funds are safe trading is ongoing this is not a forest trading platform where you see activities you see the candles fluctuating in and out you see your your entry you see your support line and your resistance level no it's not a, a forest trading platform Right, this is 100% arbitrage, right? Trading from the back end, 
scanning through, looking for opportunity to buy you and say, right, like, just look at the market uh, are picking up now. Three months ago, I told you uh, AAS uh, 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 is privileged now to start trading as the market is very low. Right? Remember, we started trading when Bitcoin was at sixteen thousand three, sixteen thousand four hundred dollars. This evening is going up seventeen, eighteen. Uh, are trying to hit up to nineteen thousand dollar level. It's okay, right? As the market uh, 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 move up, the market uh, the market trend keep growing. AAS keep making massive profit for the members. So don't expect to see a candlestick fluctuate uh, fluctuation uh, uh, from from your back office, from your dashboard. No, 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 no. What you are looking at is just the dummy page that a uh, report back to you. Your profit is here, you can withdraw, your capital is here, you can withdraw, the trading is from the back end. I didn't build front end trading. Those who build front end, they have a lot of issues, a lot of exchanges. Okay, let me remind you something. Uh, a month and three weeks ago, right, Binance was giving us some restrictions, right, of the timing we are going to trade. Those of you who are in, I dropped that screenshot in the room, there is what Binance are coming up with that. The robot we have, on ground can only trade from uh, 6 a.m. in the morning, right, to 12 noon, right? Because we were building from the front end to do the trading, just like people you know that robotic system trading their system. But we came back to say, no, this will delay us. We need to build from the back. And so we collapsed that structure and we program a different thing entirely to trade from the back end. Because from the back end, it's like the market is there, the APIs that are operated to the market are there trading, but something is behind fishing, having assets. So, Matthew, every exchange you are seeing has their robotic system trading for them. Yes, every exchange has their robot. But we didn't build a front end trading activity, rather, we build a back end. So we take from the back end, if you want to see, that's why once in a while you see me go in, do a screenshot, do videos of what is happening, the activities, the buy and sell, the profit booking, how milliseconds are running per trade, right? I'll do all of that and send to you because I don't want you to get bothered. Don't expect to see trading like candles, no, 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 do see, it's Abrahamic, you don't, you don't need to see all of that. You don't need to see all of that, please, right? You don't need to, so please, you don't need to. But trading is ongoing and profit is being booked per second. Yeah. Thank you very much, CEO. I think one question that um, you didn't really complete uh, later on that I want to bring to your notice before I take uh, a live question is that I have that that have to do with uh, the 20, uh, 48 to 72 hours time frame for top up to be picked. That is there any solution that you are putting in place to make sure that top up can be picked in addition to capital for trading within 24 hours yeah uh, i think uh 25 okay 40 48 hours ago i dropped a message in the room that we are we are adjusting the setting right we are adjusting the settings to make sure it falls in between 24 hours not 48 hours uh what i want every one of you to understand is this is a new system now they are commands you are given but the system reacts against them, right? That does not mean the system doesn't want you to take care of implement them. You go back and adjust again, right? What we plan was 24 hours deposit in, pick it up and come up to the market and do the trading. But here, the system kicked them out, adjust itself to 48 hours. It was 24 hours. Now, if you, if you look at return on investment, all of a sudden, return on investment, uh, move from uh, that is uh, 11 a.m. African Nigerian time to 1 p.m. Adjust itself, right? Then returning back to return that is uh, the the capital sum up, right? Uh, instead of 24 hours, it's adjusted itself to 48 hours. So we have to go back to the system, adjust again to make sure it's falling between that 24 hours trading. Then once you fund your account and the money drop in the system, the system should pick it up immediately. Then those who are having a withdrawal issues, immediately your Yeah, I think this network is on our neck again. Yeah, see, you. we're waiting for you. Immediately, immediately yeah, your withdrawal fail, 
the system will return a payment back to your back office for you to do a new withdrawal, right? Those are the two things we are working on now to make sure that the depot is picked up within 24 hours. Then if you place a withdrawal, the withdrawal fail, the system will return the withdrawal back to your back office for you to do a new withdrawal. But if you are doing deposits and you have a failed deposit because you over delay to meet up with the timer, it will take you three days for us to respond to you. Right? So these are the three things we are working on, putting up the settings. I think before the end of uh, this week, all of these three settings should be done. 24 hours picked up. Any deposit you draw the system should pick it up within 24 hours, not less than 24 hours or more than 24 hours. Then uh, the withdrawal, if a withdrawal fail, the system should return it back to your back office, not calling us, not sending mail to us. You go in there and tap on withdrawal, then the system will, Im uh, will immediately approve your withdrawal and send to uh, a desired wallet, that Binance, Coinbase, and the rest of them. So those are things we are currently working on. We are adjusting the settings to make sure we all need to stabilize that. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much, CEO. Uh, let us quickly take one or two questions uh, because this AMA has already brought us to the top of the hour. We are right here at almost 7 p.m. It's just two minutes to 7 p.m. So I'm looking right now to my list. Uh, I'm here to find anyone with a hand up right now. So um, no one. Okay, it's... Maybe we don't have a question yet. Then let me go back to the list because I can't find a hand up right now. Uh, okay, I think I not at all. So let me go back to the list. See you. I can't find a hand up at the moment. Um, we have one more question here. Uh, I think this is not really a question. It's more or less like a advice from up to about uh, twenty different patterns have sent this to me. And that I believe they are still more on this call. They love see you so much. They care about you so much. So they are saying they will, they are begging and they are you know um, asking you to please be conservative with informations. That um, a lot of uh, the time we are holding our armor, most of these people may be here, and um, that if information is not given, they will not get more to do. That you should please talk a little less. Don't give us so much tough information. Uh, they want you to be safe and secure with your family because they know your happiness will bring the outcome of uh, the AAS out. So they want you to please accept that advice. More than 20 Spartans have spent, sent that messages across to my DM. So see you. Uh, what are you saying to them? It's just an advice from Spartans who loves you. Thank you. Thank you for your love, but I uh, have it on the back of your mind that whatever information we drop in the room there, you can't use it and hack us. It's not possible. I filter information. I whatever I'm seeing, I speak in part. Give them to you in part. You learn in part, and we hold back in part. So whatsoever info I'm dropping in the room there, the screenshot, Either approval from Twilo, from Binance, from a uh, 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 blockchain, TRS, you can use them to hack us. Those who are fighting to hack, these are programmers. That's what they do for a living. It's like calorie. That's what they do. Or kidnappers, right? That's what they do. So they, they, they don't need uh, uh, those paperwork to hack you. No, those are not things they use in hacking. But they go after real platform, not fake platforms. Yeah. Thank you, but thanks for your love. I love you too. Ambrose, are you still there? Yeah, sorry, see you. I never knew I didn't unmute myself. I'm sorry for that. Yeah, thank you very much for that brief. I said I would be taking one more question before we go on off this call because it's already 7 p.m. Uh, the question here is that, uh, now that uh, uh, now that the funding and withdrawals are ongoing as you requested, do you have an estimated time? of when the blockchain will open for more features to be integrated 
as an example, like percentage, the auto compounding, and so many other things. So now that people are already withdrawing and funding, when is the estimated time expected for the blockchain to open for you to start integrating these features? See you. Thank you, Ambrose. Your audio is really breaking. Please, you need to work on it. But uh, let me let me answer the question. You don't give blockchain time. Ask any uh, any uh, blockchain developer around you, or ask any programmers around you, ask tech guys around you. The the worst you do is to give blockchain time. You don't do that, right? Once it's open, you see it is open. We are here. I want it open so that work. I want to work. I want to deliver. I want you to make money. Yeah, because more money, more members, more money in the liquidity pool, the more AAS grow, right? But the what you do is to look at it as a sign of opening up. Then you say in five days' time, you'll be so disappointed. Ten days, no, you don't do that. Just give it time. Once it's open, once it's open, it's open. You see it open. Integration some will go in as fast as anything you can think of. But don't wake up and tell me that 10 days, 15 days, 30 days, no. If you listen to me very well, you hear me saying January ending to first week of February. Those of you who were in the platform the first thing that yesterday, you hear me saying that it may be earlier than that, but don't give blockchain time to be disappointed. Thank you. Thank you very much, CEO. I want to really say you have done well tonight. Uh, actually, we are right here now at four minutes after seven. I'm sure it's a better time for us to bring this meeting to a close. So allow you have a nap, CEO, and uh, every one of us to go back to our duties, especially now that there is no hand that is up in the um, our life program. So I want to appreciate the 3,190 persons that are still very much present on this call this evening. The CEO appreciates you, AS appreciates you, every of our, uh, the admins that are here on this platform appreciate your tenacity, your time, and your effort. It's hanging on, not that you have nothing to do, but you choose to be here. And I believe that you were satisfied. And I want to also say to other Spartans that who sent in their messages, or even right now as we are on this live armor, messages are still coming to my DM. And if I couldn't take it, please forgive me. It's not a deliberate action, but uh, uh, it's due to uh, the task at hand. And uh, as so many also raised up their hand that we couldn't call you before you went off, also know that it was not a deliberate uh, action. Uh, to our, uh, our major admins and uh, selfless serving admins, we want to say thank you very much for the good work you are doing on the platform for all that you do daily to see that every member, every Spartan is being attended to. Certainly, you will not go unrewarded. It's only a matter of time. And want us to double up our efforts for more tasks is ahead of us. So thank you very, very much. And I'm sure I'm speaking the mind of CEO as well to you all. So, 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 we have come to the end of this very meeting this evening. Uh, CEO, what will be your parting words to uh, your beloved community before we give room for every Spartan to say what they love to you this evening. Thank you, see you. My last word to every one of you is to build more confidence for AAX. AAX will not disappoint you. And Jess and Michael is doing everything possible to make sure we don't disappoint. And have it at the back of your mind that it is a long-term project, very long, very long. And remember, your funds are safe. The liquidity pool is locked. Not even Jason can go in. It's only the robot we design that can take money in and bring money out to pay. Outside that, it will be locked for life. So thank you. Thanks for your belief. Thanks for your love. Remember, my unending love for you is to see you have your financial freedom. Stand tall above your pants, paying bills without stress, and helping the less privileged, the homeless, the widows, the widowers, the government of your country through tech. You can help them, they need help. Never you'll be deceived, the government of your country need help. You can help them through tech. Thank you. I love every one of you. See you at the top. Bye-bye. I love you. Bye.
Thank you very much to you. I thank you so much. So we appreciate that. Right thank now, you, we'll be giving opening the room to all patterns from wherever oh, you are we win. to say something nice to the CEO while we wrap up. Yeah, it's open to every Spartan. You are free to. I unending love, love to you. you. So much. Yeah. Oh, wonderful to see you. Thank you for the host. It's good to hear from you all the time. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 Thanks to everyone of you. I love you all. I love you all. I love you all. I love I will now see you again in another thank you uh, in few days from now for another armor. Have a lovely yes, weekend. Yes, yes. God bless every one of us. AAS to the moon. Yes. Bye bye. Bless you. Bye. Thank you so much.